All right, we are full. We are so back for real this time. All right, I knock it. They're yeah. going in. Starting to pull on out here. Yeah. Most employed snackers and doghouse. I too relate to being employed as I am now employed. This is going to be super unserious, super fun. And double touch so much. We see Yogi getting right back off the side. We see the Falco side be coming out. All of them get back and get both of them in the up again. Hit by the back here and the up here. And uh, yeah. The thing with doubles is that everything kind of goes so fast. There's so much going on at once. That's really hard to look at like both as four characters as opposed to two. But you see, most of the players really try to keep centered stage and try and push that advantage. Push it too much. They might have pushed it left. Okay. We'll do this. Alright. We'll do this. This and that. Both of them going on. Right Max is going to be losing their first stock as the Sonic getting hit by that laser. And Sonic loves to go back and forth, but when you have two characters, it's a lot harder to camp. You get hit a lot easier to whip Sonic. However, Lydia is coming in, gets that dash attack on Queso going up. Queso is still going to be alive, though. Keep him going back. Olivia with the F throw gets sent off stage, though. Queso going to be making back. Using the side B to get back aggressively. Very, very nice. Both of them still staying in this. However, Olivia is up to 162%. And you, uh, Rymax's percent is going high already. Yogi tries to go for the F match. It's not going to be it, but the Sonic forward air hits them both. And the up smash from Livia takes both of them out. Beautiful. Honestly, Livia just holding onto the stock so, so well. However, going to miss the ledge there with the up B. And we'll get up smash. Now everyone at two stocks of P. However, Rymax at a much higher percent than the other ones. But you are Sonic. You can kind of avoid that stuff. Both of them going around. It's going to be them. Livia getting caught a little bit in the back and forth. Hitting Rymax up above trying to get it. Ooh, I love the attempt from Yogi there trying to get the chase with that back air to get a really early stop. Send Livia off the stage. Both of them off the stage. The off stage battle off the side. The spring is coming in. All of them off. They all get back to the stage safely. No one going to die to an edge guard. Here we try again. But Livia finds the hit. Doesn't get a follow up off the down throw. Rymax. And Queso firing all over on the left side. Livia again snipes and the up smash coming out, finally taking Rymax as Queso finds a down air onto Livia. And both of them going to stop to one. Most employed sniper taking a decisive lead right now. And this is what you want to see in doubles. You want to get that advantage. And once you get that advantage, that is exactly what you are looking for. Both of them can even have the stocks are fresh and all needs to stock. The percents are high, but as we say, the backer comes out from Rymax, taking out Queso's second stock, sending Queso onto that fresh blast stock. Oh, and Queso's got Livia in the blender. We see their combos coming out. However, the neutral air drag down is not going to come, but Livia's still taking a nice 66%. Rymax getting bullied on the platform there by Yogi, finding the up tilt into up air. Again, the combo trying to find it, finds another neutral air, and Rymax has not been able to land. Gets on the platform, eats an up smack. And Rymax and Levia both these hyper percents and Yogi still living with this robot right here as the F smash comes in, hitting the teammate that is the thing in doubles. And I think that was the F smash, maybe from Queso, and Livia loses their last stock. It's Rymax against the world, needs to get through two of Yogi's stocks and one of Queso's at 111. Does the uh, neutral B, the homing attack, and you can't get punished in this. Oh, I love the attempt there, tried to get the back air while Sonic was in the forward air, but getting hit by the forward air themselves. And yeah, he goes for the back throw, but the laser hits Yogi, and they're just eating away at Rymax's life. Send his head going up, Rymax trying to find the hit. You can find a kill onto Yogi, and then a quick one onto Queso. Rymax can still find a way back to Sonic. you are very fast, you can get it. Right. Hits the forward smash, hitting Queso away. Tries to go for the edge guard onto Yogi, it's not going to come out. The side B allows Yogi to get back onto the stage safely. Both them going along, that side B having... So little like on the platform, both of them getting hit by the laser. Rymax going to be the one sent far, doesn't have the side B to get back. He's able to get back, able to get around the leg trap over a moment. However, eats a back air from Peso, and they will go. Game one will go to most employed smashers. God, I love doubles names, they are so so funny.
<sighs> Going into game number two, no character swaps from either side, both them thinking teams. And I really did like Tavos from Ryan X and Olivia. I love that up smash because both their first stocks send them into an early lead. They can definitely do this as long as they don't let themselves get blown up by the Rob and Falco combos. Or get hit back and forth like this a little bit with the neutral air. However, they're going to escape pretty early. Combo's going to be dropped. And the Falco going to come, saving Yogi from big Sonic combo. If they're going to be able to get back, both of them just using those up there. Ooh, I love the air dodge from Yogi there. He's got Rymax off stage now. What's going to do? Uses the side beat. Gets the stage spike as well. Very, very nice. That's an early stock that you love to see. Ron, let's go employed Smack. This true. We love being employed. Here we go, going back to it. Livia also losing their first stock in time, but I was looking away. Both of them going back, however, Queso is pretty high. However, oh, the spike comes out, sacrificing an early stock. One of their own teammate stocks from Queso take out Livia. However, Yogi is going to fall to their death as well right after that. But you will take that. You are at two fresh stocks on the red team to one uh, pretty fresh stock and two almost on stocks. So that side B takes Rymax's second stock, both of them one stock apiece now for their winners, doubles, lives, Kiss the Yogi doing very, very well here. And you get able to get around by guard, Livia comes around, hitting his, their own teammate, and the spike comes out, spiking his own teammate once again. Uh, just the Rob things, I guess. Either way, it does make it a much closer game now, now it's only three stocks to two. And the percents are looking a lot better as well. Lydia with the most percent. He's an up there trying to edge guard Yogi. Still looking pretty good as Rymax comes in for the save on the edge guard. Yogi's gonna come in though and find the down air. And once again, we are in Rymax too. He needs to take the stock from Yogi, but Yogi has a much lower percent. And they find neutral into the back area. And you see Yogi going so deep for this, trying to find the edge guard. Goes for the forward air, but isn't able to combo off of it. Both of them just going around each other, finds a neutral air, tries to go for the back air again, isn't going to hit it, but finds an up air of his own. Gonna keep going, finds the back air, gets their own teammates. <laughs> I, I think Yogi has done more damage to Keso than everyone anyone else has done to Keso this game. Which is really something to tell you about. They're trying to get these combo hits in, they haven't found the decisive hit yet, the get attack comes out. Going to whiff the grab from Keso a little bit too slow there. But the up throw comes out, the up air not going to do anything, collides with the spring. We find the grab, it's going to be the down throw into the down smash, and most employed smashers will take it 2-0. Oh, really good stuff by Rymax and Lydia, though. Good stuff by the doghouse.